My name is Shaggy Wayeko and today I'll be presenting an audit from North Devon District Hospital regarding the impact of elective arthroplasty enhanced recovery on length of stay and mortality. Enhanced recovery began in North Devon District Hospital in 2011, initially focusing on patient education and physiotherapy. This was by means of a therapy-led joint school and patient information leaflet provision. With the formation of the Rapid Recovery Group in the latter end of 2018, the multidisciplinary and multimodal approach to enhanced recovery, which is often commented on in literature, was commenced. This group aimed to relieve waiting list and bed pressures by optimisation of the pathway for patients. This order aims to evaluate has that pathway been improved, and this is by looking at length of stay and mortality. It was a single centre audit looking at hip and knee elective arthroplasty. Using a generator, a randomly selected month was applied to 2018 and 2019. 100 sequential hips and 100 sequential knees from each year were looked at, totaling 400 cases. Electronic records and a third party database were reviewed. The 2018 cohort was deemed the pre-enhanced recovery group and the 2019 cohort was deemed the post-enhanced recovery group. Looking at the results for knee arthroplasty, the average length of stay in 2018 was 3.47 days. This reduced to 2.29 days in 2019. This was a statistically significant reduction. There was no change in mortality. However, the 0% 30-day mortality was below the 0.2% 30-day mortality and the 1% 12-month mortality was below the 1.6% mortality that can be seen quoted in literature. Looking at hip arthroplasty, the average length of stay in 2018 was 3.67 days. This reduced to 2.69 days in 2019. This was a statistically significant reduction. The mortality in 2018 showed a 0% rate of death at 30 days and 3% at 12 months. There was no change in the 30 day mortality. However, there was a reduction at 12 months to 2%. This was not a statistically significant difference. Of note, the 2% 12-month mortality in 2019 is below the 2.7% that is often mentioned in literature. This slide incorporates data from Model Hospital. It is looking at the average length of stay for both elective knee replacements and elective hip replacements. It covers the final financial quarter of 2019 and 20. For elective knee replacements, the average length of stay in North Devon District Hospital was 1.8 days. For elective hip replacements, the value was 2.4 days. This earned the trust the rank of first nationally for total knee replacement length of stay and fifth for total hip replacement length of stay. There have been many interventions actioned by different team members. These are some of the changes which we believe to have been most influential in improving patient outcomes. Joint school and patient education have optimised preoperative patient factors. Interoperative standardised local anaesthetic regimes have led to less pain immediately postoperatively. This allowed for early mobilisation with torus frames, which is now nurse-led instead of physiotherapy-led, resulting in over 80% of patients mobilising within four hours postoperatively. Furthermore, a shift to small doses of oxycodone instead of oromorph have resulted in less nausea, allowing for better engagement. These are just some of the changes which have resulted in our significant improvement in length of stay and throughput. Thank you.